Adventures with Paul. Hey yo, welcome back to Adventures with Paul. I hope everybody is having a great week. Today's episode. Yeah, as you can tell, ever since I got that bike, I've kind of like to just get out and ride it around. So I'm going to give you another bike adventure, this time on a different trail through DC. And as always, you're going to get a meal in there. I know, you guys are ready to just get after it. I'm ready. Are you ready? So let's go. Welcome back to the test kitchen. You've seen breakfast burritos on several episodes. Today, I'm going to show you how to make one. So let's get in here and get after it. Gonna start by adding a little bit of butter to a non-stick pan. You can see that the butter is melted, so we're gonna add the eggs. And when you're scrambling eggs, you need to make sure that you continue to stir them. And they'll set eventually on their own. So just keep stirring, don't stop. Taking them off the heat for just a second. I'm going to season them with some salt and pepper. And I'm going to add a little more butter back into the eggs. That's going to kind of help it stop cooking a little bit, but also just give it more flavor and texture. Let me show you what I got here. So we put the scrambled eggs in the middle of the burrito and I did two sausage links just in the microwave and then I just cut them up and then we're going to give it some of this yellow bird and serrano chili sauce. All right, when we're folding the burrito, this one's kind of baked, so let's see how it goes. You want to go from the sides, tuck them in, and then start to roll it over just like they would at any restaurant that you like to eat at that has burritos. Uh, you don't want it to come in. All right, so it's set up like that. And then we're gonna grill this in the pan just so that it gets crunchy on the outsides. It's the same skillet, I'm just gonna put it down in the pan and we're just gonna let it sit for a few seconds. Uh, probably about a little over a minute or so. This is what you want. And then we're just gonna flip it. Ooh, that was hot. All right, guys, so there you have it. We got the breakfast burrito. Oh, I almost forgot. Taste test. That's what you guys have been waiting for. All right, here we go. You can see this breakfast burrito. Mmm. Mmm, crunchy. A little heat from the Serrano. Egg is cooked perfectly. Mmm. 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 Today I'm standing outside of Audi Field and I'm going to ride the Anacostia River Walk Trail. Um, this is the home to the DC United, the new home to the DC United. So let's go on this adventure. Audi Field was also home to the XFL's DC Defenders until the league shut down during the pandemic. So we're just gonna continue on and see what we can find along here. Generals Park, home to your 2019 World Series champions, Washington Nationals.
they're building up this entire part of DC. It was a plan as part of Nats Park uh, when they built it to revitalize the downtown area. So let's see what else we got over here. This is the Navy Yard. And this is the Anacostia River. So this is actually the West Bank River Trail. I've never actually been on it, but it says it's gonna take me to RFK Stadium. So I'm just gonna kinda ride along and see where it goes. West End Trail actually takes you to RFK Stadium, which you can see in the background. And check out the channel because I actually went to RFK uh, in one of my first episodes. So give it a look. Kingman Heritage Island. Never been here before. We might as well give it a look. Pretty neat. Trash collected. RFK in the background. We have made it back and it's time to put the bike in. Hey guys, welcome back. Well, as you could tell, trying to get a little more creative with this episode and I'm riding and filming. Um, we'll definitely have to get you back to Nats Park and get you some more facts there. So that'll come at some point. That trail that I was on, so towards the end of the ride, I figured out where exactly it started and kind of went around to. I think it's a 12 mile trail in total. And I'll have to do that in the near future because now that I know, I was actually fighting the uh, the clock because I had parked my car near Audi Field and I only had a two hour time limit to get there and back and I needed to get something to eat and all at the same time. The like button's there for a reason. So if you liked this video, smash that like button. As always, subscribe to the channel so you can stay up to date with the most recent episodes. And as always, keep it positive, keep it stoked. We'll catch you on the flip side.